Hey guys, it's Jess from My Magical Planner and I have um, a bit of a sticker haul here for you. I think I have 10 different shops. The top ones I've opened and taken out of their packages just to make it easier. The bottom couple just came, so I haven't even opened those ones yet. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this massive stack off to the side and we'll start with the top shop. From Glam Planner, I got these three different things that kind of go together to make one big kit. So I have the Thing of a Bob mini kit here, and that was about $17. And then I had the Glitter Headers, which is a $3 add-on. And then I also got both of these overlays. This one is the washi overlay, which is about $5. And this is the full box overlay, which is also about $5. So all totaled about a $30 kit here. And I'm kind of amazed at it. Look at these beautiful, beautiful full boxes. And the fact that you can then add on these glitter elements, because they, they line up so perfectly. I'm not sure if you can see that through there, but they really add something to the boxes and I think these are gonna be really fun for summer. So in the mini kit, you get the full boxes, then you get the washi strips, which adding the glitter on these, I think is gonna be amazing. Helps if I turn it the right way, right? And I like the fact that she has a work here too, as well as just your normal washies and date headers. The next page is a, you have deco on this side and these are more functional stickers, which is really nice. And then you have a page of just boxes and more icons. So I love the fact that she includes a plane tracker on here and that's really fun. I also, I think this is the only one that I've seen where she kind of does the ribbons on her days of the week tracker. Plus you have this box here at the top to either write in or use a sticker to put what that is. Like, I wanna say that I saw a dinner sticker somewhere, but it might be in a different thing. <laughs> So anyhow, you could put a dinner sticker there, write in all your menus, it's awesome. And then you do get a couple of the glitter headers with the kit itself. And you have these longer to-do list ribbons. You have a nope sticker, as well as some more decorative boxes. And then you just have this little glitter header. This was a $3 add-on. So that's what I have for Glam planner. I'm really looking forward to using that. The next shop that I have stuff from is Scribble Parents Co, which is another amazing, amazing shop. So she does her printing on glossy paper, but it's really nice glossy paper. So I have one, two, three kits, and then a foil. What does she call these? Is it a foil bundle? I think it's a foil bundle. So I'm gonna start with, I think, the smaller stuff here. So first of all, this was a, I think a sampler that I grabbed from her, which is really nice. I wanted to check out her foiling and the type of her stickers. So that's really awesome. And then in here, now most of these, I think the overlays are like $3 and then the, the doodles are like $2.50. So I have just a Disney one here with like little Mickeys and little Mickeys in the corner. I thought that would be cute to add to a page. And then this one is all Disney quotes and I got this in the hollow. I love this talk Disney to me. I think that's great. Um, I'm done adulting, let's go to Disney. I feel that, <laughs> believe in magic and feed me Mickey waffles and tell me I'm pretty. <laughs> I just thought they were so funny. And then this one, also in hollow, um, says things like, it's kind of fun to do the impossible. That's the real trouble with the world. Too many people growing up or grow up, sorry. If you can dream it, you can do it. 
The way to get started is to quit talking and begin doing. So true. So love those. And then this is a foiled doodle. I don't remember if this was $3 or the $2.50, but I thought it would be really cool and can go with a lot of different spreads. I love the fact that you have, so I don't know that how well you can see it there, but the top one is the, the small world clock. And then actually, I'm not sure what number two there is. You have Mickey apples. You have a little planner here. You have the Mickey donut, a rainbow with Mickey's, the castle, he ears, a Mickey bar. You even have like a holiday Mickey hat, which is nice. So this is really, really versatile. And then I got these. I want to say these were around, I think the smaller ones were $2.50 and maybe the bigger ones were $3. But these are all the different parks you have all the rides that are in them. So if you're pre-planning, hey, I wanna make sure I get X ride or whatever, I thought they would be really fun. Or if you're going back and being like, hey, these are the rides I rode at that park, it would be really fun. Then I can't remember if this was a freebie or a something I got because it was on clearance. But it is, I think this is the Paris Castle with snow. And I just thought it was really pretty. It's a bigger vinyl sticker. Actually, this might be the, the one that I got. And this might have been the freebie. I can't remember. But I love the fact that we have declutter, me time, laundry, all the important stuff, including target runs. I mean, who doesn't need a target run? This I know is a freebie. And it says, your voice was the soundtrack of my summer. I love that. And then you just have a few hollow icons here, including scribble prints, happy mail, which I want to order some more. I have a sticker problem. Oh, here is more of those little doodle icons. So this one is the variety. Uh, I love the fact that she has a little map there as well. So, and your little wallet with a Mickey on it, some Starbucks Mickey coffee, you know, the, um, the scanner for your magic band. And then I thought these were so cute. I want to figure out something really fun to do with these. Just little Polaroids of the castle. So that's the little stuff. And then in addition to that, um, I'm going to do foil next. I got this foil bundle and I think think it was called something magical. Hold on. Let me think. Um, I think it's the foil park bundle, maybe. So I think I went through in anything that was foil that was <laughs> Disney. I was like, add to cart, add to cart, because she was having a sale. So the first one is just these Bushy boxes. Pretty standard. And then you have these overlays with, they have Mickey and stars and moons and hearts. So you have these ones that are just kind of in the corners and then you have the frames and then these are all headers and you get two of those as well. And then you have more headers, washi tape overlays, as well as just some little icons here and then the dates and you get one of those and then you have more icons here and all of your scripts that you might use for a layout are here on the end. So it's really nice. Now her overlay bundle, I want to say this is about $17. And now we can get into the little kits that I got. So I got, I think, two ultimate kits and then a mini kit. So I'm going to start with the mini kit. So you guys can kind of see the difference between the two, because I really debated. A mini kit is $16 and an ultimate kit is like $27. So it's a big difference as far as price goes. So you have a two box little additional sticker and then you've got of course your 
if I can get them, <laughs> your eight boxes here of full frame stickers. I love that you have two full boxes that you can choose from here. I love both of them, to be honest. And then you have a sticker with your days of the week and little, you have work here and little icons on this side and your days of the week tracker here. Then you have some habit trackers, some movie ones, a couple of checklists. You have these little headers and some glitter headers down here. And then a box of, you know, just decorative boxes. I especially love this one with the little Mickeys in it. So, so cool. And this might be my favorite washi out of all of them. It's just, you have these subtle little Mickeys in the background and I love the colors. So you have a full box, which would be great for one of those overlays. And then you have just big thick washi, which you can choose to cut down if you wanted. And then your date headers. So that's a mini kit. And this is an ultimate kit, which I did add into this one a couple of things when it came because they went with this kit. So let's see if I can get it out. Her, her packaging is a little skinnier, I think. So sometimes it's hard to get it in and out. But the additional items that I put in here are I bought the additional um, girl boxes because I wanted the redhead. <laughs> And then I got a page of doodles that was in the coloring of the kit to go with it. So your two box here is a vertical two box of this really cute girl in front of the castle. And then you've of course got your eight boxes here. And I love the fact that each park is represented. Oh, and I forgot to tell you the name of this kit, sorry. It's called Magical 50th, Magical 50th for Disney's 50th anniversary this year can't wait. I'm debating if I'm going to use this the week of their 50th or if I'm going to wait to do it whenever I go because I don't think I'm going to go that first week. Anyhow, so I love that all the parks are represented. I love that there's a packing here and the balloons and just this little outfit and Mickey and Minnie are so awesome in these colors. So then you have this, and these might be out of the order she sends them in. <laughs> Sorry, guys. So then you have decorative boxes, some really big, like, layering icons. I'm really not sure what I'm going to end up doing with those. And some flags and some other icons here. This washi is also amazing on this kit. So you have, like, these shooting stars and, of course, a blank box here. Really, really cute. And then a whole page of just boxes for headers and like decorative boxes. So you have varying sizes on here, everything from, I think these are one fourth boxes and these might be one third half boxes. It's, it's really cool. And then you get a second page of those type of decorative boxes. And then you get this page, which is very similar to the other kit. So you get your glitter headers, your important kind of word overlay, your word headers here, your trackers, the movie ones, and the checklist and everything. And then this one has your deco on this side and your days of the week and everything on that side. And then it also had these, two, this last page has two full boxes. You have four of the half boxes. I love the squares actually. And then two more checklist. So I think the big difference, let's kind of look because I was trying to put this together in my head. So the washi, the washi pages are the same. Okay. <laughs> if I can pick it up. So then you have this page, which would be the equivalent, I think, of, of this page. Okay. And then you have the glitter header page, which is this one. And then the deco page. 
and then the front page. So, okay. And they both kind of have that stuff. Okay. So these are what you're getting extra when you get the ultimate kit. You're getting an extra page of the decorative boxes. Well, actually kind of two, and you get two more full box prints, plus all of these decorative boxes and this page. So my thought was that with the ultimate kit, I can probably break it up and do two layouts, possibly even three, depending on how I do it. So I feel like the extra money is worth it, but you can, I think also a la carte, some pages, I'm not positive which ones you can get. And then the last kit, which is also an ultimate kit that I got from her, was her Beauty and the Beast kit, which I don't see the title on that page. So hold on, let me pull it out and see if I see what. Does she name it? I don't think she named it on here. Her newer ones have the name on the kit on the side, but I don't think this one does. So you get this washi, of course, page with all of your days of the week. I'm not the super fan of this washi, actually. It, I don't know, the floor pattern. Yeah, I think we could have done better, but it's okay. Um, I really like this pattern here, as well as the damask pattern over here and this blue one. I just, I, this one is my least favorite is all. And then you have your boxes, more boxes, more boxes. And this is your deco sheet. I think it's interesting that you have shoes in here. Those are really cute. I, I might've rather had a dress. You have a um, plate of cookies, this little magazine from Victorian times. You have Lumiere and Mrs. Potts, the Rose, Cogsworth. I mean, it's a really cute deco kit. And then I loved, I think this was the reason I bought the ultimate kit is because I wanted this sticker. <laughs> and then here is her artwork for the big full boxes, which I also thought was quite stunning, especially this one. Oh, absolutely loved it. So that's all I have from Scribble Prints Co. Now I have a new shop that I was just trying out. Her name is Meg B Makes and she's just a small Etsy shop. I love the fact that she hand lettered my name here and it says handmade with love. This is a really cute, just little thing. And then she had this little folder here that says gratitude, the quality of being thankful, readiness to show appreciation for, and to return kindness, which I just thought it was really sweet. So inside here, she has a little thank you for supporting my small shop. You're awesome. And she includes these freebies, which are beautiful. I love these little butterfly ones, perfect for the time of the year. She has a days of the week thing, as well as these cute little flower boxes and decorative elements, really fun. So I think all of the pages she has in her shop that are of this nature are $3. I think everything I bought was $3 a sheet. She has these foiled frames. I got them in gold with their, her neutral theme, which is a pink kind of a, I don't even know what to call this color. It's like a light pink, but almost tan. And then this is a very neutral off-white color at the top. And then I got her, she had some floral boxes that I thought would be really fun. And this is her warm tone. So you have a very light pink, kind of a normal pink, and then this purpley mauve color at the bottom. And then I picked up one of the circular ones because I wanted to try out these as well in her neutral. So you have varying shades of tan there. This one is also in gold. Then because I'm always like, I don't have date stickers. So I bought a three pack of her date stickers, which give you, let's see, four 
sets of 1 through 30 on each page and I got it in her gold, silver, and rose gold because those are the colors I most often use. Then I got some walk stickers in gold and YouTube also in gold, film edit upload in gold, and I got two of that one. And then she also includes this really sweet card with a handwritten note, um, which is thanking me for buying stickers from her, which is really, really sweet. So I highly recommend checking her out. These ship super fast, possibly one of the fastest shippings I've ever had. Like, I want to say within 24 hours, these were in the mail to me, which is kind of amazing. Next, I have just one kit from Paper Me Use Crafts, and I can't remember the, the price on this kit. I know it was on sale. So um, it's called Sunflower. And it, you could buy this like extra page for it that perfectly matched color wise. So I went ahead and did that. And this kit also is just absolutely beautiful. So you have this page with the one really cute box. It is foiled in gold. And so you have the full box up here. Oh no, those are. Those are headers, sorry. So you have headers and then all the full boxes down, well, not full boxes, decorative boxes to write in there. You have a little bit of deco and some flags. Here is your washi for this kit. I love these sunflowers down here, so, so pretty. And I almost feel like this washi should be vertical. Is it just me? Maybe it's just me. And then on the side you have all headers and then you have these kind of arrow stickers on the side. And then this is the full boxes, which are absolutely gorgeous. And by the way, these are on a matte paper. And the gold just really, really brings out the sunflowers in this. It, it's amazing. I'm not sure how much you're picking up on that on camera, but it it is really cool. And I love the fact that she added a row of boxes here at the bottom. I don't think these stickers are any smaller than your normal stickers. So I have to look at how she ended up being able to add that row on. I like it. And then here are your days of the week and your habit trackers and checklists and all of that. And then at the bottom, she includes your date dots, which is so nice. So I'm looking forward to also using this kit. I think it's gonna be amazing and beautiful. This next shop is called Planning with Jazz. Now these are $5 kits, okay? Here's her little freebie, which isn't she the cutest Malaya? <laughs> and then, oh, this was to Paper Muse Crafts. That was her freebie, sorry. And so I had ordered this for May the 4th. Her kits come pretty standard here. So you get a four box, four full boxes on here. And the artwork is really, really cute. So you have that one and then you get a second page with full boxes as well to kind of fill that out. You have some checklist, a weekend sticker, some little flags and some icons on the side. And these are headers and then a habit tracker and some decorative boxes as well as the cancel. But for $5, I thought it was pretty good. And I really, really liked the artwork. I will probably end up buying a couple of things to kind of fill out the kit a little bit. So that one's May the 4th. This one is called uh, Planning, or no, Princess and Friends. So you have all of the princesses and like these little sidekicks, it's so cute. And then for this kit, you have just this pastel kind of theme to go with it, which is what she uses in all of the other kits that I'm gonna show you. So I'm not gonna bother with those page and just show you really the decorative elements. This one was an Easter one, which I thought was adorable. So I'm going to 
going to hold on to this until next Easter. I absolutely loved Ariel with her bunnies here and Belle with the little chicks. So, so cute. And then the last one that I picked up was this summer kit with all of the different princesses in their swimsuits, which I thought would be fun for a beach day. So, so cute. I think this is my favorite one up here with the pineapple. And I'm actually, which princess is that? Is that Moana maybe? No, Moana's here. Who would that be? So we have, okay, hold on. So we have Jasmine, Belle, Pocahontas, Cinderella, and then we have Tiana, Merida, and um, Mulan, or not Mulan. <laughs> Maybe that's who that's supposed to be, is Mulan. That could be, because it's kind of got an Asian feel. Yeah, I'm gonna go with that. If you think it's somebody else, let me know. <laughs> that's all I have from that shop, and... Next, we have this really cute stickers. My only critique on this sticker shop is it did come from overseas. And while I think the wrapping here is very cute, I would have liked a little bit more protection on the stickers. So it's called Oodle, Oodle Mama Doodles, I think is how you say it. So I'll just kind of do a close up there. And all of these will be listed down below. So it comes with this live for today, plan for tomorrow little sheet. And she has this cute little card that's double sided. So you have a lighter skin girl and then a darker skin girl on this side, which is really cute. And then she includes like a little business card. And this is, I have to figure out how you, you do the, the rewards for that. And then these are her freebies, which I think are super useful. So I can't wait to try those out. That's in a rose gold and this is her gold. Both of these were freebies. So that's really cool. Her date stickers, she just kind of puts on a separate sheet. So you have that here. And I'm just gonna I think most of the kits are pretty similar. This is on a matte paper. It is really smooth, so I like that. Okay, and her kits are rather large. So they're 12 pounds, which means they end up being about $17, but I think I got them on sale. Well, I know I got them on sale, but I can't remember the price. So you have eight full boxes here and then these third boxes at the bottom. And this one, of course, is Mary Poppins. I think that's gonna be super fun to use. You have work stickers, a little bit of washi down here. And I love this one right here. And then you have all of these checklist stickers, some decorative stuff. I love the fact that she has writing on her deco here, which I think is really nice. And then, these little flags are super cute. So we have bills, we have, her habit trackers are a little bit different in that she has, I don't know, they just look more elegant to me. I think it's the font that she uses. I love the fact that she has a fuel up here and a relax and family time. Then we have a full page of just decorative boxes and you have not only your standard size boxes, but she also has this little corner where, I don't even know what size to call these. You have these little rectangle boxes and then slightly bigger rectangle boxes. So that's really cool. You have a page of checklist with third boxes at the bottom. And this one has like your meal stickers as well as like these little heart ones, some TVs, and then other icons down here that you can use. And this one has kind of some glitter headers there, some bow headers and today's to-dos and then a variety over here on the side. And then I believe this, wait, did we have days of the week already? Hold on. Oh yeah, this goes to this. It's called Practically Perfect. 
just saw that. So this is her washi. I'm not a big fan of this, but I do like the blue and I like the days of the week and these and I'm really pretty fine with that. The next one is called Devious Diva and it's Ursula themed. I love this artwork of Ursula. I think it's amazing. I also like this box so that you can write in it and everything. I just, I really liked this kit. So the format is pretty much the same. So I'm just kind of kind of flip through this for you guys. I like this one. A woman doesn't know how precious her voice is until it's been silenced. So amazing. I love that quote. And here we have more deco, our decorative boxes, which she has clams kind of in the background here with pearls, which is so pretty. Here, checklist. I just love the colors of this one. And then here's your washi with more of those shells and like this little black plant. I don't know what to call it. I want some bubble overlay tape to kind of put on this. The next one is No Way inspired for fall. And of course you have hair with the apples here. You have a nice drink, the little fox. And this one's quote is, remember you're the one who can fill the world with sunshine. Nice weekend stickers. I do think that these kits can probably do two week spreads. So definitely bigger kits. And here's her washi on that, very fall-esque. Then I bought this Harry Potter kit, which is called the School of Wizard. And I, I love the castle. I like the artwork that she chose. I mean, it's first, I think it's their first year at Hogwarts in this and it's just really cute. The Polyjuice Potion, was that second year? I don't know. Um, we do not need magic to transform the world. We carry all the power we need inside ourselves already, which is really fun. And then for her decorative boxes on this one, you have different elements, which is really cool. And your habit trackers are all, like you have a broom, a, a golden snitch, and the sorting hat, which is really fun. I thought this was really hilarious that your sorting hats are here on your checklist. And this is a very neutral kit. I liked the little bits of pink and kind of purple that she added in in a subtle way. And here's your washi on this one. Very, I don't know, medieval maybe. <laughs> then there was this Pocahontas kit. What did she call this one? Colors of the Wind. So I thought this was beautiful as well. I like this artwork of Pocahontas especially. And oh, I don't remember the, was it it's the grandmother in the tree, but I can't remember her name. And yeah, I just thought it was really nice. And then her quote on this one is, sometimes the right path is not always the easiest truth. <laughs> and again, this is just really, really pretty. I like that she has the little leaves in here. And this one, she added in these uh, scalloped, I don't even remember what those are called, but you know, those boxes. <laughs> so I think this might be a newer kit. And then we have our leaves here. This will be really fun to use in the fall. And then of course our other ones. And this washi is super pretty. Okay, that's everything from that shop. Now we can get into the shops that I haven't really opened. So this one is from Joyfully Planned. I think she's doing a clearance sale right now, but her, her sheets generally run about $4 a, a sheet. And I did open this one up just like that much to make sure all the different ones were in here.
so you have her little, this is her freebie, it's a little um, card. And it's really, really, really pretty. She's overseas, where is she at? Is it New Zealand? Uh, the Netherlands, so tulips totally make sense. This was another freebie, and it's just exercising girls, and she also sent me this freebie. These are all of the different, well, I think you can do different combinations, but you can pick the hair color and the skin tone, and she has, like, this foxy as well as a red hair. I can't remember. I think I got mostly foxy, but I might have done some of the others. And then she also lists the number of what she you can find them on, which is really nice. So I think this might have also been a freebie that she sent me because of the size of my order. <laughs> but this is really cute with the birds and everything in the flower deco. And then she sent me this sticker, which I think is adorable for planning. Okay, so these are her smaller icon stickers, which to kind of give you an idea, they fit perfectly in these one third boxes with just a little overlap. So these are her filming person. So she has her camera up and she's filming herself, which is really, really cute. Next I have, I think this is called healthy eating. And you have just various different like salads, smoothies, the veggies, the fruit. It's really nice. And then I got her cleaning sampler, I think it was. So you have making the bed, grocery shopping, laundry, trash, sweeping. Oh, I guess there's two makings of the bed. So, and this is her redhead. So to kind of give you a, an idea of the difference, so this one is definitely a lot more red. So this is also a cleaning one that she has. And then this one you have like windows and mopping and groceries and laundry and all the things. <laughs> it's, it's really awesome. This is her therapy sticker, which I thought was awesome as well. And I just like her little thought bubble thing there. This is her hairdresser one. So you have her, yeah, sitting in the beauty chair with all of the, the scissors like doing their thing. Then we have, this is part of her weight loss ones. So you have the little girl on the, the, the scale because the doctors would like me to lose some weight and I'm in agreement with them, so we're trying. And this one is her planner stickers, kind of like mix, I guess. So I love these little girls on the side. Well, honestly, I love all of them. But, and this one has her taking a picture of her planner for Instagram, which is really cool. This one was kind of her summer travels one. So you have her taking a picture. I love the airplane ones. They make, crack me up. And then you have her going somewhere in her Jeep. And then this is her sitting on a plane and hiking. Just really cool. And then I got a full page of her just doing all of her things, like cleaning wise. So I have that one and then there was this style as well for cleaning. And I got a painting one because I'm hoping to feel well enough to paint soon. <laughs> I would love to paint the kids bathroom. So that's everything from Joyfully Planned. Love this shop. She also ships fairly quick. So, and her quality is awesome. Okay, now for the shops I haven't opened at all. This one is from White Deer Stationery. This is, I think, my first order from her. I've heard lots of really awesome things. So, I think she had like a little bit of a sale and I was like, hey, I'm just gonna try it out. So it comes like this, oh, look at that. She has like a little deer horn on there, that's fun. 
So how do you, is that, oh, okay. It's just looped through that hole, so it's not affecting anything else. So then your stuff is in the paper bag, which is nice. And then this is all of my, oh, here is her freebies. Let's open, oh, I like the little deer print. So cute. This envelope is really nice too. It's like a waxy envelope. So her freebies, her cards, oh, I like that. Little alarm clock, I like this paper clip too. A printer, oven mitt and pan, and a shopping bag or a gift. Cute. Okay, so she used that same little deer print to close the plastic bag. So I think I got one kit and a bunch of like little doodles. So this is the kit. Okay. It's just like a little three page kit. And so you have your check boxes down here, your to do's, your habit tracker, some icons, some third boxes, some half boxes. And then these were the full page stickers, which I thought were really cute. I feel like there should be another page, but this is the Mother's Day one. And then you have this really sweet washi and I love this Happy Mother's Day down here. And then you have these headers here as well as a couple more decorative boxes. So a small kit, but I think it's gonna be really nice. Okay. And then I got some appointment stickers. I got some popcorn to go with movie night. I got these little cars for when I take Ethan driving. I got dinner plates for planning out kind of meals. I loved her little skates. So I got a page of those. I got a page of sneakers. I got a page of scales. Um, dentist appointment, little teeth. Um, this is for, I think, okay, my camera flashcard was full, so sorry about that. So then I got these Apple Watch ones to remind me to do my steps, so I think that'll be really awesome. And then it's just some little journals here, and these are also really cute. So that's all from White Deer Stationery. All right, next, let's see, this one, this one's from somebody overseas, it's from Portugal. Um, I don't remember what shop this is. Oh, okay. So this is Hello Petite Papery. These are kits that I've been so excited to get also a new shop to me. I, I got a bunch of these in the, in the same sale that I got those other Disney kits. So, okay, I think this might be her freebie. Oh, look at that, that's on the bag. Oh, so cute. Oh, so this is from her Beauty and the Beast collection. Her beauty is found within. It's just a little card, but I, I really like that. So, and then I think this was like a tiered freebie or something. So her paper is really thin, it feels like, but nice. So probably a premium mat um, or a mat. I'm not really sure, but you have some full boxes and everything here. That's cute. That'll be nice to add to some kit. And then I did get the deco to go with all the different kits that I got. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you that when I show you the kits, I think. So I have four kits. And these are her bigger kits. She has smaller kits too. So I don't remember if she calls them like ultimate kits or just full kits or what the deal is, but I thought they were really pretty. So. Okay. 
So this one obviously is Cinderella. So you have her carriage here and some really cute florals. So it'll be nice for layering and Cindy herself here. And then you have this deco that matches really nicely. And then you have some check boxes and then some decorative boxes down here. And I like the fact that she used a telephone here as well as you have two TVs, a house. This one's like a bill pay one and a little asterisk. So, and here's your to do's um, and uh, glitter headers are mixed in there. The only thing I will say is that this is so busy that you can't really read some of these, but it's still really pretty. And then you have her flags and checklist on the side here. You have two bill dues, um, payday and day off. And then there's your washi. So it is a smooth paper, but very, very thin, which can be good. I mean, it helps with the bulk of your planner. So the next one I got was her Ariel kit, which will be I think all of these are the same format. So I thought this was really pretty with her red hair and everything in the, yeah, I'm gonna be doing a lot of aerial kits this summer. I can see it now. <laughs> Here's her days of the week, really cute. I like these decorative boxes, I think this is a newer kit than the Cinderella kit. So she probably switched some things up. I like these boxes as well with the little bows. And then here's your washies and this page. Oh, so you don't get a full separate page for the to-dos. That's nice. So I think this will work probably better for me. And I like this font. And then her... Her deco for this one was this with flounder and you have like little shell seat flowers and of course a dingle hopper or two. I, I just really like it. So, okay, there's that kit. And then we have Beauty and the Beast, which this is super cute. And our deco for Beauty and the Beast is um, you have Chip and Mrs. Potts, a little book, the rose, and just some floral there as well, which is really fun. I think this was also a newer kit. So you have... Of course, this one that I already painted out. I love this picture of Belle from the back. It's just really cute and the rose is really nice. And then you have your checklist. Oh, this one does have the separate sheet of the to-dos and everything. And then you have flags and all of that. And all of these boxes, these are so cute. And then there is your washi for the there's your washi, and oh my gosh, check out those bows. So cute. Okay, this was a deco sheet that doesn't go to a kid. It is just like a, <laughs> yeah. It's for all of the times I go to the doctor. So it's just a doctor page. <laughs> and then I got a grab bag, and it looks like it is Alice in Wonderland. I don't remember if Grab Bag was her version of Oops Kit. It might have been. So there is Alice in all her glory. I think she's beautiful. And the cups here are so cute. And then you have your check boxes and that sheet of to do's and odds and ends and all that. Oh look, there's a little Santa clap. I must this must have been like a Christmas kit, maybe? I don't think of Alice as Christmas. That's interesting. I may take those and use them with something else. I don't know. And then you have all of these. And there's your end washi. So that's all I have from 
Hello Petite Papery. And our last shop, Drumroll, is a UK shop, I think. Let's see, who are they from? Oh, House of Stickers. So. Sometimes it takes so long for things to get here that I've forgotten what I've ordered. So I actually don't remember what I ordered from House of Stickers. Not that it was like astronomically long. I just have a dory brain. Oh, that's cute. Okay. So this must be their like little card. It's really big. Really big. But I like it. Yeah, I like the little sparkle on her outfit. So, so cute. Oh, and it is double-sided. I wondered about that. This is super smooth as well. So it looks like that is my invoice, so we'll kind of set that off to the side. And then we have... These are super cute. These must be their freebies. Very beachy. And then this is their freebie. I think for this, I think everything else is over here, but I, I can't remember if this was a, oh yeah, it says 40, and up, 40 pound and up freebie. <laughs> there you go. So it's like the little beach freebie and it's cute. So, Excited about that. And then I bought this freebie, or not freebie, <laughs> deco, I don't know what you call it. Illustrated scripts, it says. So you have takeout bins, which is the UK version of trash, walk doggo. I don't have a doggo. Can I walk kiddo? Maybe. Anyhow, birthday, game time, super fun. And then I have these two kits. So, they're both beach themed. I may be set for summer kits. Maybe I need to stop ordering them. <laughs> I have to go look. I know my sticker collection has grown immensely over the last couple of months. For better or worse. Oh no! The sticky just took off some of the sticky on the sticker. So this one's Believe. And I liked this sticker. I really... I wish my desk looked much neater than it does. <laughs> so this is my dream desk. And I liked the black and peach. I thought it was really pretty. And then you have the deco here and you have the scalloped. I don't, I need to remember what these are called, but you have all kinds of different layering elements there as well as kind of little header stickers there and then a full page of just write on stickers. And these ones are, I think these ones are just header stickers here. It's interesting that there's this gap here. I don't think I've ever seen that on stickers. I don't know if that's supposed to be that way. I do really like these. Actually, I saw somebody use these type of stickers someplace and I thought that was brilliant. And that was in gold foil and this is her hollow foil. So, let's see here. Oh, if I can open it, her, her bags are very, very sticky. I will say that. Which is both good and bad, you know. Okay, so the side. So I thought this was really, really cool. I think this was the first kit that I saw from her that I was like, oh, I really want that one. So I love the little sun and I got this in hollow because I thought it would be really great. And I love the seashells and this little palm tree thing. And there's your days of the week a little seahorse how cute and all of your layering elements and everything on this one and your checklist oh look at the dolphin I love the dolphin 
yeah, I'm excited to use that as well. <laughs> okay, guys, that's it. That's all my stickers <laughs> for the month. <laughs> and I know I have more on the way. Oh my gosh, what did I do? <laughs> I think I was having a bad month and tried to compensate a little bit. <laughs> Anyhow, if you like this haul, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button down there for more sticker hauls and planning videos. Until next time, I'll see you guys later. Thank you.